What's going on, everybody? Kevin Walsh back here for the New York Sports Machine. Brooklyn Nets update. Now, not a lot to talk about this team. They've just not been very good this season, but they just waived Joe Johnson. They're probably their best player, maybe right behind Brooke Lopez, but it doesn't really matter. This is not a good team, and they're not going anywhere. They don't even have draft picks. They're really in a rough situation. Waving him, obviously, to save money, and it's money well saved. Just, there's no reason to keep him on the team. Um, the, the real question, though, to look at is, where will Joe Johnson land? Um, he's going to be a hot commodity now for these top teams that are competing for a title. Obviously, the Cavs are going to get their name in the running. Uh, I mean, they, they already have Richard Jefferson, and you look at Joe Johnson, and, and Richard Jefferson plays for them. Joe Johnson's a probably much bigger upgrade than Richard Jefferson would be. So Joe Johnson would play for them. That's some really good scoring. And you also just, due to the, how the Cavs season ended with injuries, as much depth as you can add, uh, another scoring option, I think that the Cavs are definitely going to pursue Joe Johnson. I, I don't think the Warriors are going to go after that. They just got Varejao. Um I mean, I'm sure they could try, but I, I don't know if that's for them. I could see maybe the Spurs reaching out, um, always wanting, you know, they can always add depth, and obviously that could be attractive for Joe Johnson. But I think the Thunder are the team that need to make him priority number one. You you look at this team, it's Russell Westbrook, it's Kevin Durant, and they really don't have a, a third guy who can scare you. Ever they, they were at their best when James Harden was their sixth man. And listen, you, you're you never really going to see a situation where someone as talented as James Harden is going to be your sixth man. Um, and, and they've tried to, to fill in various ways. They had Reggie Jackson, but similar to James Harden, not to the extent, but he got too good to play that role. He now starts in Detroit, and rightfully so. Um, they tried Jeremy Lamb. That didn't work out all too much, and they got Deion Waiters, and that's been really rough. He's been really bad for them. Joe Johnson could be perfect for the Thunder. Probably wouldn't start, but coming off the bench, a guy who's very capable of getting his own shot still, averaging uh, just a shade under 16 points per game, I believe it is, on the season. Um, so the Thunder really, really need to make him priority number one. I think this is going to be a two-way battle between the Cavs and the Thunder for Joe Johnson. We'll see where he lands. We'll keep you updated on the New York Sports Machine. Comment down below where do you think Joe Johnson is going. We'll talk to you guys next time.